Oh, well, Ramadi, thanks for joining us. Uh, Fine score tonight, Arvin Meadow 1, Pollock 2. How do you think tonight's game went? Um, first half, I didn't, I didn't think we'd come out the, the traps at all in the first half. Credit to Arvin Meadow, I thought they dictated the game in the first half. And, uh, it was a pretty dominant display for them, which is quite surprising for us because I think we've, we've been playing well recently and we've, um, we've been uh, quite aggressive in our approach and, uh, you know, in terms of you know, um, going and being very, very competitive in the middle of the pitch. And, not just the middle of the pitch, all over the pitch really. And I thought, I just thought Evan Meadow just started the game much better than us and um, deservedly took the lead. Uh, I'd have to say that. I think their, their kind of dominance in the game, kind of, you know, um, they deserved the, the goal um, when it came. It was a poor goal for us. We don't stop the cross and uh, unfortunately we get punished. So we, we accept that. Um, but obviously I wasn't happy at half time with the, with the kind of level of performance. Um, I just felt we were. You know, even on the in possession of the ball, you know, um, we gave it away. We turned it over far too cheaply, looking at it back, and, and we played into their, their hands a wee bit. But it, credit to them, you know, because they came up with a game plan, you know, to, to go and be highly competitive as well, which I know uh, this club uh, has always been. So, um, you know, so there's no credit taken away from them there. So they deserve their, 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 their lead at half time. Um, half time, there were certain messages given to the players that just obviously. You can imagine, just wasn't he, wasn't he happy with how we, we went about things. We had to make the change with, with Matty Grant. Obviously, he's carrying a, a wee knock, and um, he, he comes off, and McGregor comes on and makes an impact. Ryan makes an impact um, straight after half time, we get the goal. Um, the second half, I thought we were much better, I thought we were much more competitive. I thought we, um, we, we, we went and we, we, um, we imposed ourselves in the game, and, and we penned them back, and we, we, we limited them to very few chances. Second half. And credit to the lads, we kept at it, kept at it, and we got the goal at the end. And as I say, Adam, Adam's just an actual finisher, and it's a, an outstanding take, and it's an outstanding touch and, and finish for Adam. You know, so credit, credit to him on a night where he could have been disappointed not to start the game. You know, uh, it's credit to his professionalism, how he's come on, and he's, and he's like I say, all the boys are coming apart, and he, he impacts, and he certainly did that with the goal. So both the players that we bring on the part of the night make significant contributions and impacting the game and scoring the goal. So. I'm delighted, I'm delighted for them, the show of character was fantastic. Uh, and Johnny Lyon signed a new contract with the club uh, last week and again another excellent performance for him tonight. Johnny was, you know, he's a fantastic young talent, I'm over the moon that Johnny's committed to the club. Johnny's over the moon to, to be here, he's, again he's asked for a platform to play and he's got the, he's got the biggest platform there is, you know, to go and, go and play to our level, so, you know, thoroughly deserved I have to say, in terms of his new, his new contract. So absolutely over the moon. His performance tonight, middle of the pitch, moving, being versatile, going and doing a job for the team on the right side. It shows you how um, how much a team player he is, and, and you know, and how much a good player he is. He's able to do that. You know, he's able to. He shows a level of maturity beyond his years. So, uh, no, delighted for him and delighted with him as well in terms of his performance levels. And the win tonight sets things up nicely for Saturday's game against Elkin Lake. Top v second. Yeah. Um, Obviously, massive game, so it'll be the biggest game of the day, there's no doubt, there's no doubt about that. Um, I don't even know how the rest of the results went today, so I, 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 have, no, I have no idea this evening. So, um, but no, it'll be a massive game and, and we'll need to be at our very best, um, as we as we always do. Um, so, we'll prepare, uh, we'll get ourselves ready, you know, physically, mentally, we'll get ourselves ready for the game. And, um, and we'll go out on Saturday and we'll be you know, doing our very best and try and, try and win the game and try and give our, our supporters some, some more to cheer and continue our, our good run of form that, that we're on uh, just now. So, um, so yeah, th really looking forward to the game to be honest with you. It'll be a fantastic occasion, really looking forward to it and I hope our supporters are looking forward to it as well because it's been a while since we've had a big crowd and a big game like that. So, um, you know, um, really, really looking forward to it. Alright, that's brilliant. Thanks again for your time. Thank Cheers. You.